Welcome to Gouache with Anne. Today I'm painting Montreal. This beautiful church in Lahai Park was completed in 1859, uh, but the Baroque facade was actually added in 1889. I've been wanting to paint this church for a while and I've done quite a few studies on it. I just didn't know which angle I should take, so what I decided to do was wander around and see the different viewpoints. I was thinking, should I do more of the detail of the church facade? Should I do the angles of the light coming through with the columns? And in the end, I decided I would do a straight on view with the pool in the foreground and leading straight to the building in the background. It reminded me of the Taj Mahal, which I quite liked. And uh, I also liked that the, um, the trees framed the, uh, the church as well. This composition is probably one of the easiest to draw. It is a one point perspective and your eye level is right on, straight on at the center. So all the lines converge onto that point. So in this composition, the focus is mainly the pool that your eye goes down towards the fountain at the end and the orange doors of the church. The church itself isn't as much of a focus as a backdrop. And then the trees nicely frame the whole picture and keep it very contained. The way I've approached doing this painting is, you can see I've done the sky, so the background, and uh, instead of doing the church next, I decided to do a little bit of the foreground, put the pool in place and do some of the sides, and that way I get a sense of what that area is going to look like. As you can see, the facade of the church is very complicated. All I'm going to do is make little marks to indicate some of those shadows, some of this structure. And in the end, because it's in the background, it, it will read like you, it, there was a lot going on. But if you looked very closely, it's very rough. So even though my reference photo doesn't really reflect this, when I was there, the, um, the pool itself is a much brighter turquoise. Uh, so I decided that I would really emphasize that. And I really also liked that it matched the statues that were on the church.
like with the pool, you don't always have to paint uh, your subject in exactly the same colors as you see. I decided to paint the trees instead of green, I'm painting them more in blue shades. I'll put a little bit of green, but mostly it'll be blue and uh, darker blues. Here you see I'm using my Titanium White Windsor Newton, which is a very opaque white. And it's great, especially to do something like the fountain and all the little droplets of water that are coming off. I like to include at least one person in my paintings. It gives a sense of scale to the painting. And I was quite happy there was a woman standing there with her dog, so I enjoyed including that. So here's the finished painting and uh, I think it turned out quite well. I'm quite happy with the water in the front and the way the trees frame the building. So I hope you enjoy it too. So thanks for watching and don't forget to hit the subscribe button below if you don't want to miss out on any new videos. Comment if you have any questions and I'd be happy to answer them. Like the video and keep watching either the next video on the left or playlist on the right. See you next time.